everyone! So apologies for all of the junk in the background. Today I'm going to do a winter haul for you, basically showing everything that I bought this winter. I know it's a little bit late since it's spring now and stuff, but whatever. I got a lot of cool things so I thought I'd show you. Firstly I'll show you stuff that I got from Off Your Tree, which is an alternative store in my town city thing. I don't know if they have it in other places. The first thing I got is a bag by Reapsville 666. So this is it. There's the sides. And I got this on clearance. I got it for like $30 and I really love it but it's already breaking and I only got it a month ago or something. It's breaking here and also starting to tear at the front if you can see is really disappointing so I don't really know what to do about that. I might see if I can get it fixed. I got some really cool socks from there. I'm not usually one to go crazy buying socks. Actually I am, that was a lie. But these are all like two dollars each and they were marked down from 13 or something and these are also by Creepsville. So these ones have bones on them and they say dead girl. I really like all the stuff that says Dead Girl, but I've been kind of hesitant in getting stuff that says it for myself because it's like a bit too specific for me, if you know what I mean. But these are cheap and they were cool when I like them, so I don't like these as much, but I just got them anyway. And they have stars on them and this little skull with a bow. These ones with a knife and blood. Ooh, spooky stuff. And then got these are my favourites. I got these bat ones, stripy bat socks. Next thing I got from there is a really cool jumper, which you've probably seen before if you saw my Busy Buzzy Bee video. It's this, this one. Oh, it's really cool. It's got all these pretty symbols on it and stuff. And there's the back. And I love it. I love it so, so much. Sorry if you can't really see that, this is a bit awkward. Jumper is by Sweet Vengeance, I think. All the stuff that I got from Off Your Tree, that I'm currently wearing this. It was a jacket, it's by Trip NYC, which I know could be a little cringy for some of you, but I like it. Yeah, it was originally a jacket, but then, sorry, I cut off the sleeves and modified it and stuff, so. So that's the jacket. Really sorry if you couldn't see that properly. And then, also, the first patch that I got on there was from Off Your Tree, and it's just a killing joke one. I also got a poster of The Smiths. It's from their Meat is Murder album, but I don't have it with me because it's in storage, so I can't show you that. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure that's all the stuff that I got from Off Your Tree. I got my friend bought for me just from a cheap shop. They're these gloves, and they're stripy, and they're all Halloween colours and stuff. I went to JJ's. I kind of just went in to get a belt, but I got some other stuff as well. I've already used some of these, so it's open, but I got these little face stickers. And I also got the necklace that I'm wearing with the stars on it. This one. I got one CD, which I got from a market and I'm super happy with. It's the Labyrinth soundtrack, which is super cool. And I, like, I was listening to it constantly after I got it. It's so good. Then I've been working at my sister's shop recently. I'm not anymore because I got a different job, but I just can't help buying stuff whenever I'm there. So I got some stuff from her shop as well. It's Vintage Carousel. I got this cute card from there, which she actually gave to me. It was a congratulations thing. I got Chocolate Marmalade Tea by Scullery, which I haven't actually tried yet. I've had Chocolate Marmalade Tea before, but not the one that's by these people. I think it'll be pretty good. I think. And then I got this. This is by Scent Wild, which is also at my sister's store. It is, oh, it lost the sticker, but it's called a skin drink. It's got like aloe vera and mint, possibly tea tree oil, I can't re quite remember, but all of this stuff in it, and you put it on your skin and it's like giving it a drink and it feels like really refreshed and nice and cold. And I got it for summer, I don't know, it would help me out. So there's the inside of it too. It smells delicious, it's like, whew. <laughs> like so refreshing like putting mints on your skin or something I don't know <laughs> that's a bit weird actually I got some tie-dyed pillowcases it's a bit hard to show you since it's already on the pillow I love tie-dyed stuff in case you didn't know which might seem a bit strange if you haven't watched my videos before and don't know me that well and I'm just the random gothling but I like I like tie-dyed and I got this and it's 
by the fabulous scavenger i believe they're called and they do a lot of cool tie-dyed stuff I'm mainly in blues and they've done some things in green but yeah blues her partner um does photography and stuff so i don't actually know how this goes but she gave it to me but he made the photo so i don't really know how that works but it's really cool it's kind of creepy and stuff and i really like it next thing i got was a bit random i actually found it at a lolly shop and it's a real scorpion in a lollipop. I'm not actually gonna eat this or anything. I just got it because it's it's a dead scorpion and I like dead things of course so there's that. They also had ants and chocolate which I thought was a bit weird. I got these things from a market that I sold stuff at. It's all like vintage stuff and handmade stuff that's locally handmade in Adelaide or in South Australia I guess I should say. So first thing I got was a delicious chai latte scented candle and it smells so good. I haven't actually burnt it yet, but I will probably in the new house. Mmm. Oh, I wish you could smell that. It's so nice. From there, I also got what I'm wearing, a little wolf patch, which I really like. I got some books from various bookstores. So this first one I got from a secondhand bookstore. It's an autobiography of Morrissey. I think it's pretty impressive that he has his own penguin book, I have to say. <laughs> then I got I'm Knock the Devil by Anne Rice. Hopefully I said that right. This came from Savers, which is like a giant op shop around here. This actually was from Vintage Carousel as well. It's really old. It's The Nervous Child, and it's a medical publication. It's kind of interesting. I got I Hate My Selfie by Shane Dawson. I have mixed feelings about this book. I don't know how much of it I'm meant to take seriously and how much I'm meant to realise is kind of a joke. Some parts were funny, some parts were kind of cringy. I don't know, but anyway, I was curious, so I got it. This is from an op shop. It's The Money Lender's Daughter. I haven't read it yet. And then from that same op shop, I got The Raven and the Rose, which I also haven't read. And then from Dimmicks, I got Second Graveyard Book Graphic Novel by Neil Gaiman. I got some antiques, so I went to the antique fair with one of my friends. Actually, it was an antique market. We didn't actually go to the fair. We went to the market, and the fair was next to it, and we didn't realise until after, but I enjoyed it anyway. From there, I got this random key that hadn't been cut, just because I could, and I like keys. I got a sort of World War II bullet. Apparently, these were used to shoot into sand dunes or something like that. I can't quite remember now. This is my favourite thing that I got from there. This is some Victorian opera glasses, which is so exciting. <laughs> Inside. Yeah, that's them. So, yeah, they, they're a little bit tattered, like I need to kind of fix some stuff, but yeah, pretty cool Leo. Also from the antique fair market thing, I got something that was an antique, a gothic choker. It's actually the first one that I've ever owned, <laughs> and I've only worn it a couple of times. It's here. I have a feeling this has been used before though, because one side of it is all stretchy and weird and a bit thin, and the other side isn't. So I don't know. And then I also went to the antiques market, but it isn't actually a market, it's just in town. I'll show you the photos first because if you don't know, I collect antique photos, mainly morbid ones like of cemeteries and stuff like that, but also anything else that kind of catches my eye. So I got this one, which says on the back, dome on top of morgue. So that's pretty cool, it says it there. So that's a little photo. This isn't a cemetery, but it's a cool sloop. I believe they're called. I got this gravestone one and then a couple that are standing in a cemetery together. That's the real big exciting thing. Got a fur. I don't know if you can see all of this but there's its tail. I love its tail. I'm not actually sure what animal this is. I was told it's a fox and I, I don't know. I mean it's too big to be a mink but I don't know if it's a fox. I don't really know. If any of you know, please let me know because I don't. Really cool. And it was really cheap. It was $20, <laughs> which is amazing because they were having a fur sale. A old tin. It's had mushrooms in it and they were belites, which is what I really like about it. So. I just really like the design on it and I love that it like, wasn't the usual agaricus mushrooms. They were belites. 
The next thing I got was a rosary, but I changed the cross that was on it into one that I already had because I didn't like the other one, so this is it. It's the cross that you would have already seen before, probably. Next thing I got is just a random headband for my dreadlocks. I can't remember the name of the store that I got this from, but it was just from a little country town. Next, I went to the op shop and got a cool shirt. Yeah, so this is the cool frilly shirt. Sorry, it's so hard to show you. Really not a lot of room in here to do this. Okay, next thing I'll show you is on my jacket before I forget. I got these from my sister. She just gave them to me because she found them in her own collection of stuff, I think. So I got this little brooch upside down. It's a pineapple, like those little lollies that you get. And if you don't know, I love fake food. Don't ask why, but I collect a lot of it. So, okay, I don't know where that's gone. I also had another badge on here, but I don't know where it's gone that I got from her, but it was some little mushrooms. I think this is the last thing. I got this from my mum because she's awesome. This is a jumper by Ridgeline. It has a deer skull on it, which I love. It's really cool and it has a really big hood that actually fits over my dress, which is amazing. And this is so warm, it's really good. So when I can be out in the forest and stuff in the winter, it's still really warm with that nice jumper. So that was my winter haul. Thank you for watching. I apologise that it was a bit rushed, but I have to be somewhere right now and I'm already really late because I chose to do this instead. I'm probably going to do another one of these, but for spring, that's it. So thank you for watching.